Hi, Katie. Hi, David. Today we are gonna talk about how to increase our reading speed with few simple exercises. That's exciting, David. In speed reading, we need to change or modify some traditions or habits we have been used to when we were still kids. Most, if not all, youngsters have been taught to read word for word. Although this is the common way of teaching reading during the early stages of development, using this strategy longer may not be healthy in the long run. This article will introduce some speed reading exercises that you can try out to help improve your speed reading. Practicing these speed reading exercises would be advisable so you can determine which speed reading exercise will work best for you. The first speed reading exercise that you can try out will be targeting at making your reading speed faster. For the speed reading exercise, you can choose any book, selection, or document that you feel comfortable reading. A timer or stopwatch will also be required. As you read through the words, use a pointer such as your finger or a pencil or a pen. Slowly increase the speed of the movement of your pointer. The faster your pointer moves, the smoother the flow of your reading will end up to be. You can check how much time you have consumed after reading a certain page or paragraph. Take note of this time and continuously work to improve your record. Another speed reading exercise will not only help you read faster but will also assure better comprehension. Comprehension as well as speed will be improved in this speed reading exercise by training an individual to read more and more words in a block at a given time. You can use any card or paper such as an index card and for 5 minutes, read 3 lines at a time. If you regularly practice this speed reading exercise, you will later see wonderful improvements in how fast you can read through a given text and how deep you can comprehend. One of the primary speed reading exercises used measures an individual's speed in reading. This speed reading exercise is pretty simple. You will be given a certain text that you need to read. The time you consumed in reading will be calculated to come up with the number of words you can read in a minute or your general reading speed. Another variation of speed reading exercise also involves experimenting on the movement of your eyes as you read. In this speed reading exercise, you will be asked to focus your eyes and your reading in different areas. Some would include diagonal movement of the eyes, reading the words at the beginning and at the end of each line, and reading the words at the middle of each line, among many others. Another speed reading exercise would train an individual to develop eye movements that would be more effective in facilitating speed reading. In this speed reading exercise, subvocalization is minimized, if not eliminated. This strategy adopts a three-step process, focusing attention to the first letter of a word, adjusting the focus to see the entire word, and adjusting the focus to see three words at the same time. With the bulk of information that we need to read, speed reading has become a significant advantage. These speed reading exercises will be a big help to those who want to read faster, without sacrificing the quality and depth of their comprehension and understanding. However, a speed reading exercise may not be effective to all, because of individual differences. Thus, since a person knows himself or herself the most, he or she can determine which specific speed reading exercise will be most fitting. Thank you Katie for all these great methods and exercises. Well, if you want to know more about how to boost your reading speed, sing up now here for a free speed reading course by John Lying. See you soon. Bye. Bye.